Okay, guys, I have got some very good news. Apple has released the new iMac and a new Mac Mini and a new uh, mouse. It's the Magic Mouse. I think this is a very cool mouse right here. Uh, I'm definitely going to get one of these guys in about a week or something like that. Uh, they're uh, finger motions. You move through your pages. So I will talk about more of that, about that in the future. The main thing I'm going to talk about is the IMAX. Um, the IMAX now is quad core i5 and i7, which is a very, very big deal to me. Which my consumption is, like Emix said in his video he put up later today, this 2010, right after 2010. They're going to come out with Mac Pro 6 core and 12 cores. That is huge, guys, if they do something like that. Um, so, if they're making a desktop computer like an iMac, they're making it quad core i7. That is huge. Oh my god. Let's go right here. The i5 is still a uh, quad core. Yeah, it's quad core. No. Let's see, go back to i5. Well, where is i5? Right here, this is the i5. That's a quad core, 2.6 gigahertz, quad core, Intel core, Intel core i5. Now, let's say you got um, app monitor or iStat menu, whatever you use. It comes up four cores and four virtual cores. Now, if you have the i5, it's going to do the same thing as my Mac Pro does. But if you upgrade to the i7, $200 more, dollars, it, it is going to be four cores. But virtual cores, it's going to be eight cores. So, you're going to virtual cores, you're going to have eight cores. And, you know, the real core, you're going to have four. But if you have app monitor or i menu, there are going to be eight blocks here. Virtual cores. Now, if you have um, just the i5, it's going to be four all the way around. But the i7 is going to be four uh, real cores and eight uh, virtual. And I think that is a very good deal. So, the next thing I want to talk about is the uh, geek benches on i7, the new iMax. I would love to see some geek benches on this, guys. When it comes out in November, when it ships in November, um, I would love to see that. And another one, they upgraded their monitor size, 27 inches. The old one used to be 20 something, and the other one used to be, uh, I can't remember what the other ones are, but they was 20, I know that. They upgraded 21.5 inches with a 3.06 gigahertz, uh, you know, processor for $1,200. Uh, still um, two core, um, but the big thing about it is, guys, they have innovated quad cores in a uh, iMac. That is all in one computer have a quad core processor. That is outrageous. Um, quad core. That's outrageous, guys. Twenty one thousand um, dollars. If you're a designer or something like that, you even want to get a Mac Pro. Really. Um, for $2,500, you get a Mac Pro. For the i7 quad core iMac, you get it for like about $2,200. So you're saving $300. Um, when I bought my Mac Pro, it was $2,600 with tax. Um, but guys, this is a great deal. A consumer computer quad core i7. This is really going to change Apple's. Um, you know what people think about them. This is really uh, outrageous, guys. This I can't believe this. Uh, I I just seen this to, yesterday, and I just can't believe it. I bet you a million dollars. This 2010. I mean, like early 2010 or the middle of 2010. I'm just doing a prescription here, guys. They are going to come out with 12 core IMAX. I mean IMAX. 12 core Mac Pro and 7, 8 cores. They're going to have a 6 core, and they're going to have a, you know, a 12 core. 
that was mine. Um, I did too, like Emix said. I thought the same thing. I didn't think the 6 core. I thought the 12 core. But I thought they would keep the quad core and keep uh, get rid of the 8 core and just make it 12 cores. But uh, guys, that is a very good deal what they did on the iMac here. Um, excellent, guys. Excellent. This is just so amazing. Um, a few weeks from now, I'll get that Apple Magic Mouse. And I'll do an unboxing video of that, guys. And comment what you think about these new iMacs. I think they're wonderful, guys. So I will see you in my next video. Comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.